In today's video, we are going to do a quiz of class 4th EVS chapter 14, Baswa's Farm. So here it is written first question that is which is not used for losing the soil of field. So your four options are given here. First one is spade, then shovel, then sickle, then garden fork. So one image is also given here that is of sickle and sickle is used for cutting long grass. Except sickle remaining are used for digging the soil. So your answer number C is correct that is sickle. Now next question is what is irrigation? Your options are here to water the plants or crops, to cut the crops, sowing the seed or digging the soil. So, irrigation is the process of applying controlled water to plants or crops. So, your first option that is to water the plants or crops is your correct answer. Now, in this image also you can see there is one is sprinkler that is used for irrigation in this field. Now, we will see the next question that is what is weeding? Your options are here, the process of removing weeds, the process of removing unwanted plants, both of these, none of the above. So first we will see what is weed. So weed are, weeds are the unwanted plants growing in a particular area or in a particular field. So your option number A and B are same, that is process of removing weeds or the process of removing unwanted plants. So your answer will be option number C that that is both of these. Now question number 4 is which is the first step of farming onion? Watering the plants, sowing the seeds, digging the soil or cutting dry leaves from onions. So your steps for farming onions are first step is digging the soil. Next step is sowing seeds. Third step is watering the plants. Fourth step is removing weeds. Fifth step is cutting dry leaves. And then after packing and selling to the market. So your option number C that is digging the soil will be your correct answer. Now next question is the leaves of onion turn into which color when they are ready to cut. So now in this image also you can see that leaves of onions are becoming in yellow color. So it's obviously your answer will be option number B that is yellow. Now we will see the next question. Question number 6 that is identify the instrument. Now here it is given one image of any tool. So your options are here shovel, sickle, iligi and kuris. So first we will see uh, for which purpose these instruments are used. So shovel is used for digging the soil. Sickle is used for basically uh, cutting long grass. Eligi is also used for to cut dried leaves. And kurig, kuris is le uh, used for sprinkling the seeds in a field. So the image of this instrument is called iligi. And you will also... Uh, you can see in your kitchen. Now next question is unwanted plants in a field is called heat, need, seed or weed. So we know that uh, unwanted plants in a field is called weed. So our option number D is our, our correct answer. Unwanted plants in a field is called weed. Now next question number 8 is what is harvesting? Options are Digging, watering, sapling, cutting crops. So here a sapling. We know that sapling is called uh, small plants. Small plants are called as sapling. So our option number D that is cutting crops is correct answer. So what is harvesting? Harvesting is cutting crops. Here in this picture also you also can see some farmers are there who are cutting wheat crop. And this is a season of summer because there is a very uh, 
hot sun, uh, light. Our next question is which festival is related to harvesting? Some festivals are written here. Option number A is Christmas, B is Eid, C is Dasara, and D is Makar Sankranti. And these all festivals are very popular in India. So you all must know about these festivals. And uh, which festival is related to e harvesting? So your option number D that is Makar Sankranti is your correct answer. And Makar Sankranti is celebrated uh, on 14th January of each year. And it is dedicated to the Lord's Son. Why? Because on this day, Sun starts its journey towards the northern hemisphere. So in India, in summer season, days are longer and nights are smaller. While before Makar Sankranti, the sun is in the southern hemisphere. That's why winter nights are longer and days are smaller. On Makar Sankranti, people take a holiday in Ganga River. Now here in this image also you can see. Now next question is, Baswa lived in which state? Option number A is Kerala, B is Tamil Nadu, C is Andhra Pradesh, D is Karnataka. So for this questions, hint is also given in this uh, image. Uh, one map is in red color that is of Karnataka state. So your answer will be option number D that is Karnataka. And Karnataka is located on the southern region of India. Here you can see and this is also a subcontinent. Okay. So it is located on the southern uh, region of India. And it is the largest state of South India. Its official language is Kannada and its capital is Bangalore. Now if we talk about its uh, boundary region, then we will see that it is surrounded by uh, Goa, Maharashtra, Telangana, Andhra Pradesh, uh, Tamil Nadu and Kerala. So Karnataka is the neighboring state of Kerala. Okay, now that's all about in today's video. Thank you.